A truck requires a particular non-repairable electrical component that has an exponential lifetime with positive failure rate lambda failures per hour. A site supports a large fleet of N trucks, each operating 24 hours per day, 7 days a week. A parts manager can make an order for spare parts once a week. Assuming that the lead time is zero, that is, the parts arrive immediately upon being ordered, what is the minimum number of parts that should be ordered up to each week to ensure that there is a probability of at least 0.9999 that a truck is not down for lack of this particular non-repairable electrical component. Now lying beneath the surface on this problem are a lot of assumptions that are out there. For example the 0.9999 indicates that if a truck would ever go down for lack of this particular non-repairable electrical component that there's a very high cost that is extracted. Well there is also the indication here that this particular electrical component is fairly expensive and that is they don't want to over order too many of these just go overkill because they're tying up a lot of money. So there's a balancing act that goes on here in terms of the uh, problem setup. There is another assumption that's going on that is not stated and that assumption is that each truck fails independently. At least the uh, the electrical component on each of these trucks fails independently and that's not an unreasonable assumption at all. So for one particular truck the time to the next failure is an exponential random variable with parameter lambda. Now there is a result that is going to be proven in the next chapter that we're going to take for granted while working this particular problem and that is for a fleet of N trucks Now obviously for one truck the rate will be lower but if you have N trucks out there the rate of failure is going to be much higher and it turns out that the minimum of a bunch of independent exponential random variables turns out to also be exponential and its rate will be the sum of the rates of all the individual uh, exponentials. So for a fleet of N trucks the time to the next failure is also exponential but this time it's exponential and its rate is the sum of the rates of all the individual trucks each of which has a failure rate lambda so when you add up lambda n times you get exponential n lambda. So it turns out that part failure times for the fleet those failure times constitute a Poisson process with rate and lambda. So that is what the entire fleet of trucks sees is they see a Poisson process and these failure rates occur with rate and lambda. On the next page draw a time axis. Here is time and here is time zero and here is one week. So during that week we do expect to have some failures occurring according to a Poisson process of this particular electrical part. 
it turns out the number of failures per week because we are looking at a Poisson process that number of failures per week will have the Poisson distribution and the parameter in the Poisson will be 24 times 7 times n times lambda. So once we have that pinned down the parts manager strategy will be to order up to the 99.99th percentile of this distribution. So order up to the 99.99th percentile of this particular distribution. My pen is just barely hanging on. There, that's better. So if we can figure out the 99.99th percentile of the distribution of this Poisson random variable, then we will have the number of, the number of parts to order up to. Well, here is the algorithm then. What we want to do is if we have, for example, n equals 20, that's just an arbitrary number of trucks, and we have a lambda of 0.001 failures per hour, then the number of failures in a week is Poisson with mean 24 times 7 times 20 times 0.001, which gives you 3.36 failures per week. So we want to find the 99.99th percentile of a Poisson 3.36 distribution in R and that simply uses the QPOS fun function. Give it a first argument of 0.9999, a second argument of lambda equals 3.36 and this will return 12 parts. So every week at the beginning of the week when the parts manager can make the order, you should order up to 12 parts which are of course received immediately and that will give you a 99.99 chance that you will make it through the week without running out of parts. Remember you're ordering up to 12 so if you have 8 at the beginning of the week you just need to order 4 more. If we want to do a Monte Carlo check for say 100,000 weeks here's how it might go. We use the RPOS fun function which will generate 100,000 Poisson variables with a lambda value of 3.36 and those are stored in a vector called failures. So failures contains a hundred thousand Poisson random variables and then what you'd like to do is find out what is the estimate of the probability that you will come in less than or equal to 12. So anytime the failures vector has an element which is less than or equal to 12 this returns a 1. Those 1's are summed up and divided by 100,000 and this returns 0.99993 which just barely exceeds our threshold of 0.9999 as desired and so that is a way of supporting our solution which is to order up to 12 parts.